Here's a fun question. In this video, we're comparing uh, different decimals that are repeating, and we're trying to find a decimal that fits between them. So let's just list these two out um, and say what these decimals are. Just to be clear, this decimal right here is 1.725, and the 2.5 is repeating. So for myself, I'm just going to write that a couple of times. Right? That 2.5 is repeating over and over again. So let's just do a rough sketch of a number line, right? Here is 1.7. Here is 1.8. So 1.72, right? That's above 1.7. Maybe, well, you know what? I'm sorry. Let's be even more precise than this. Let me re rewrite this. Notice that it goes from 1.725 to 1.726. So really, I, f I feel like we can break this down on the number line to a very precise location, right? Here we have 1.72, right? And here we can put a 5 as well, so it's 1.725. And here we have 1.726. All I did there was go up by, by, by 0.001 from 1.725 to 1.726. So now we're going to place all these numbers in between these two endpoints to kind of understand the relationship between them. So we have 1.725 repeating, and we're trying to find a number between. So this should be our low, this number. Let's just plot that, right? Um, where's it going to be? Well, it's very close to this right here. It's just 2, 5 more, right? Because and repeating, really, you know, this is repeating over and over again. So it's just above this line right here, right, maybe right there. 1.725, which is this, and then another 2.5. And yes, the 2.5s keep going, but if you think about their significance, you know, if you have a decimal and it goes 1.725, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5, 2.
right? This point right here, 1.726, which is this, but the sixes keep repeating. So it's slightly above it. All right, so what points are between this? Well, here we have 1.742. Well, notice, and this is how you compare decimals, right? You can look at the highest place value possible. The sevens are equal here, but now this is 74. Well, if this is 72, and this, this is, you can imagine this, that this distance right here is just up to 726, where would 74 be? Well, that's two hundredths. So, wow, okay, so that's almost, it'd probably be off the page here, right? 1.742, we'll estimate. It's way above our mark here, so that's out. And again, I'm just looking at this four right here, that's, that's the number of hundredths more. And so this would be way off the page, right? Because this, this distance right here is a thousandth. A hundredth is, is, covers ten times more distance. It's way off the screen. All right, anyway. Next we have B, 1.7253. That seems like a good candidate because um, 1275 is here, right? 1276 is there. 1275. Three is slightly above this right here. Two five three, right? Slightly above this two five repeating, and you can think about this as two five and then three ten thousandths more slight amount above that, but it's still above it, and it's less than this one here because this is one point seven two six six thousandths ten thousandths right and so forth. So that's definitely a candidate. I want to circle it for now. Let's look at the others. 1.724. Well, again, 4.2, and this time the 4.2 is repeating, not just the 4 and then 2. And that's actually really tough to compare those two, in my, in my opinion. 1.7424242 versus 1.742. You can think, though, that this is going to be a little bit more. It's going to be above it, right? 1.74. 724. Oops. Oh boy, I made that mistake. I was thinking for myself that this is 74242, but it's 7242 and so forth. So actually, this is way down here. This is 725. 724, 1.724 is about, well, it's an estimation, but, but below, it's out of our range here. So that doesn't work. But I was trying to compare, if you think about what I was doing, I was doing 1.742 repeating versus 1.742 repeating. And that's not what we have here, but let's talk about that for a moment. Which one of these would be greater? Well, well, this one would be greater, right? Because the 4.2 is repeating over and over again. So here you can imagine if we kind of expand this decimal, it would be 1.742222. But here you get 1.742, 4.2, 4.2, 4.2. And even though these are, these are getting really microscopic, these measurements, the 4, 2, 4, 2, 4, 2 has to be larger than all the 2's here. So this number is very slightly larger than this one right here. Okay, one more to go to eliminate. 1.723, and that's, that's even further down. It's off our screen here. This is 1.725, 1.724, and then 1.723 is off the page. Now when you're doing a problem like this, there's no need for a number line. And you can solve it much faster by just lining these decimals up and comparing, right, the place value. One way you might do it is to say, okay, 1.725, repeating, is less than 1.2726, simply because here, when you're matching things up, you can ignore the whole part. They're both equal in the 7 tenths and the 2 hundredths. But here, when you, as soon as you get something different, right, if everything before it was the same, which is what's happening here, and compare these two digits and see which decimal is larger. This has to be larger because the 6 is larger than the 5. And this process where you line decimals up can help you quickly realize that the answer must be B in this choice, in this question, sorry. All right, well, I hope this helped. Thanks.